for my fall tablescape. And I really like this one here. This one's orange, it's a little bit rustic. It has a little fringe trim at the end. But I also like this one here. Because this one is actually little pumpkins with a damask, almost threading throughout. And I think it's really pretty. So I think we're gonna go with this one. We found some tablecloths, table napkins, but we're trying to figure out which one would match the table runner the best. So we have this one here. I like this one because it's really simple and I can use this for different seasons, but I'm not sure. I think I kind of want something that's a little bit more fall themed. But then we have this plaid one here, reminds me of the Dominica plaid. Then we have this really cute soft rustic ones. And then I found this one here with little birds on it, which I think was cute and it comes with little placemats. But the winner, I'm thinking, is this one. It's sparkly, it has little pumpkins on it. I think it's really themey, and I think it'll brighten up the table well up against this one. So I think this one here is the winner. So we're going with this one, dolls. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Picking out a new throw blanket, right? This one right here. Simple, cute. Or this one. Very simple, cute. This one's a slightly bigger, but I feel like this one's softer. Once we get back home, you'll see. <laughs> home I am incredibly tired my feet just going shopping and grocery shopping it just really tired me out and now I am like incredibly tired and I had these shoes on that Vivia sent me and I'll be doing a review on them it's this pair of shoes and then two other ones so I've just been wearing their shoes for the past couple of weeks. First, first try in many, many years. Well, maybe like in over a year. Very first try and I got it. So uh, now I'm taking this little jacket that I recently got from Zara, it has these gorgeous gold buttons. It's a two-piece matching set, but one of the buttons popped off. See how it went straight through it? It means that I need a thicker knot so it wouldn't go straight through. So I need to tie it again at the ends so it doesn't go straight through like this. Wait, like that. See how it went just straight through? I'm gonna trim off this excess that came off of it. So it in the exact spot again, right here. Pull it through and it's staying as much as I tug on it. I'm just going to take it, put it through the hole of the button, the back side, loop it through. Hello dolls! So, oh, why do I have these in? Today is a beautiful day because we are going to be doing table arrangements, okay? My nails are done, my hair, 
is done my face has makeup i'm actually starting my day kind of a bit later than what i thought i would um i worked out this morning and the fun thing is i was going through all of my home decor and i realized oh my gosh i have more than what i thought i did so every year i'll pick up one or two things ranging around under 20 dollars or so and from there i just do that each year and now i feel like i've accumulated a good a great selection of decorating items that i can use in pretty much all seasons which i love so don't think that if you just got your first apartment or your first home or you just want to start decorating that you have to spend a whole bunch of money i'm just so excited to start decorating today dolls i'm wearing this little sweater <laughs> i don't know what it is it's like a sweater top that uh, my mom gave me whenever I go to see her she always well I beg her for clothes but um, we'll just say that she gives me clothes as you guys can see right here is my little thrift store art piece that I found I put it in my dining room and it looks gorgeous so this is what we have we have our table napkins this was $14.99 at home goods then we have this gorgeous autumnal table runners i love table runners 12.99 and then dolls we picked up these little vases these are so cute these are only 2.49 at the world market next season or the next time that i'm making a tablescape i want to start investing in artificial floral arrangements these dolls are the flowers that i bought and these are beautiful red mums and then this one here it is a potted plant after taking care of this one i want me a house plant i finally want a house plant i'm ready for it dolls these are our design elements and all of these items that i have here I will have them linked in the blog post. I will have them linked down below and also similar options. Like this one here, these tablecloths, which I will go ahead and take apart. They have these gorgeous little flecks of glitter in them, which I really do love. Metallic thread. I will use these little ribbons, these little cotton ribbons as home decor for the future. These little tablecloths, they have little pumpkins on them, which I find to be so adorable. I love that. Although it's a light color, it has the metallic thread throughout. Having patterned table napkins makes it a bit more welcoming. It makes people a bit more comfortable with using them because sometimes people think, oh, they're just for decoration. And I'm like, no, please do use these when you're eating. They're beautiful and they are made to be used. just been cutting the flowers out of this here potted plant and the reason why I bought the potted plant is because I realized this cost the same amount as just getting a bouquet of red mums kind of trying to find the stem right here just try to cut it at the lowest point there we go
so I just laid out my new updates, my little fall winter couch decor, sofa decor. <laughs> um, if you all remember when I was shopping at Home Goods, we were trying to pick out which blanket to buy. We ended up buying this one because it was bigger. And after we were done filming, I was like, you know what the dolls are gonna think? These blankets look exactly the same. I did already wash this and dry it, but I really love it because we did need a new throw blanket for the couch, and I love this one. I love that I did white, and then right here behind me, we have this gorgeous cable knit crochet sweater style sweater weather. Sweater weather. Hello, I love it. It is just so so cute. I've been want I love the cable knit style and this is actually really soft, which I'm happy about, you know. I feel like it brings a lot it brings texture to your living room and it brings a bit of coziness and I feel like it pairs so well with this white blanket. Very nice. I think I'm going to go ahead and start in the kitchen. Now this is my personal preference. You could definitely lay the cobbler just flat out, but I like the cobbler to be just a little bit mixed in. This batter here is so addictive. It's really addictive to eat. I already took like three spoonfuls because it's just, it tastes so, so good. And we have a lot of cobbler mixture left. So I'm just gonna mix it in a bit and then I'll put another full layer on top.